Hello there guys, Shannon here. I am back to react to the next episode of My Little Pony, Friendship is Magic. This will be Season 2, Episode 15. And this is by far the bizarrest name for an episode I have seen in a My Little Pony show. Uh, let me just get the... I, I've completely forgot the name again. So let me just get back up, guys. Hold on. Because it's a long fucking name. I'm getting prepared this time around. Where is it? There, here we go. The Super Speedy Cider Squeezy 6000. So many questions. First off, what the fuck is a Super Speedy Cider Squeezy 6000? It sounds like a fucking product you'd buy. Something like on late, late night television. Buy the new Super Speedy Cider Squeezy 6000. Clean your house in 50 seconds. And then you buy it and it's complete bullshit. I just don't know what this episode could be about. The name gives me nothing. <laughs> We're going to just have to jump right on in. Oh, Fluttershy. Oh, who could that be? It's still dark. Come on, Fluttershy. Cider season's about to start. Cider season? <laughs> really, Fluttershy? Oh, where are we? What's the rush? The rush? Don't you remember what happened last year? Or the year before that? Or pretty much any cider season ever? Oh, uh, well, um... Uh... Pinkie Pie! <laughs> of course, Pinkie Pie! And then they always run out of cider! I guess I... Well, not this year! This year, I'm gonna get there before sunrise! So I can drink all the cider I want and laugh when she doesn't get any. It's the perfect plan. You know, I might even buy some cider and hold on to it for a while, drinking it drop by drop in front of her. <laughs> Gee, Rainbow Dash, looks like a few other ponies had the same idea. Guarantee that's Pinkie Pie. Oh, gosh, Pinkie, I love your new style. <laughs> All these ponies! Isn't this great? I couldn't sleep last night because I was so excited about cider season and I had this brilliant idea to come down here and camp out. So I told a few others about it and they all thought it was a great idea too. And now it's just a big old cider party! Oh, Pinkie Pie. Oh gosh, that's a lot of ponies. Hope you don't run out before you get any. <laughs> I think Pinkie Pie knows what she's fucking doing, I swear my to God. Pony, my little pony. God damn it. So... They're drinking cider? Is that the gist of it? A My Little Pony show where the ponies get pissed. That's new. Big adventure. Tons of fun. A beautiful heart, faithful and strong. Sharing kindness. It's an easy feat. A magic I really don't have anything to say during this because I'm still trying to comprehend the idea of a pony show doing drinking. Hmm. Unless it's magical cider. Doesn't get you pissed. Isn't this exciting, Spike? How come oh, no one decided season. to inform them they were camping yeah. out? That, means it's only that seems a dick day. move Saturday by your friends. <laughs> Attention, every pony. Saturday season is now officially open! There's a drinking season? Really? <laughs> hey, get rid again. Guess you have to. Now I understand what Rainbow Dash means by Pinkie Pie. That's a lot of gold, meaning that's going to be a lot of cider. Oh my god, how much do you need? Getting drunk is magic. Ah, nothing like it, watching your teacher get hammered. Guarantee it's gonna run out before Rainbow Dash gets anywhere fucking near it. Oh, it's gonna run out on her, isn't it? Yep, it's gonna run out exactly on her. <laughs> God damn it. Sorry, every pony. That's it for today. Aww. Surprise, surprise. You ran out again. Yeah, you always run out. For the record, I don't mind. Why can't you make enough cider for all of us? Or at least for me? Whoa, 
<laughs> I'm your friend. Give me booze. <laughs> Hold on, every pony. We've done our best to improve supply this year. You always say that. And it's always true. But Apple Family Cider is made with love and integrity. And only the highest quality apples in Equestria. Sorry, but that recipe takes time. Have you tried uh, improving your workforce? Plenty more tomorrow. She's great, you know. You can't rush perfection, and this year's batch was perfection. Uh, Pinkie Pie. I'll never forget the cider I just drank. It was a moment in, in time. forty seconds. We're going to see a disembodied Pinkie Pie. The fuck is that? What? Where's tree is that? I just asked that, but alright. Look, a strange machine's coming towards us. Let's just all go towards it. Let's not fear it. it Can be anything. Why do you look happy to see? You don't know what it is. Well, look at what we got here, brother of mine. It's the same in every town. Who the fuck are you two? Why have you got such long legs? Maybe they're not aware that there's really no need for this teary despair. Man, the key that they need to solve the sad side of short as you and I will share. Well, you got opportunity in this very Um. When the hell did we break into a musical number? Flynn, Flam. Alright. I don't know why I can't. I don't like them. Oh, you're doing my head in. Please stop. Any horse can make a claim and any pony can do the same. Oh, my brother and I have something most unique and superb. I'm seen at any time in this big new world. And that's opportunity. Please shut up. Folks, the one and know me, the biggest and the best. The unbelievable. I'm in peace. Shut up. I can believable. Grim flam, brother, super speedy, side of squeezy six thousand. I will break your face. Shut up. Really, Rarity! Really! God damn it! Uh, I don't know what it is. I just can't stand them. To let my brother and I borrow some of your delicious and might I add spellbindingly fragrant apples for our little demonstration here? Uh, sure, I guess. Ready, ready, flam! Let's bing bang zam and show these thirsty ponies a world of delectable cider. My friend. Oh, I can't stand this. Please be over fucking soon. Really? Twilight's going cider? I didn't think she'd be that much into cider. Get in their face, Granny Smith. Come on. True. Well, Granny, I'm glad you brought that up, my dear. I say I'm glad you brought that up. Shut up. See that we are very picky when it comes to cider. If you'll kindly try a cup. Yes, sir. Yes, ma'am. This great machine. That's just the very best. So what do you say then? Apples. Get a step into the modern world and put the super speedy cider squeezy six thousand to the test. What do you think, folks? Do you see what the apple stands? I see it clear as day. I know she does. So does he. Come on, Ponyville. You know what I'm talking about. We're saying you've got. I'm gonna get my shotgun. I'll be right back. Here's my shotgun. I need it now, please. I need to shut this fucking up.
Is it over? Is it over? Feedback. Well, sweeten the deal. You supply the apples, we supply the super speedy cider squeezy 6,000. Then we split those sweet, sweet, sweet profits 75 25. Deal! Hold on. Who gets the 75? Why, us, naturally. And uh, no. We'll throw in the magic to power the machine for free. Cider sales keep our business afloat through the winter. We'd lose sweet apple acres if we agree to this. So, what'll it be? No deal. Yeah, go fuck yourselves. Very well. If you refuse our generous offer to be partners, then we'll just have to be competitors. You wouldn't dare. No, oh, no. Don't you worry, every pony. There'll be plenty of cider for all of you. Once we drive sweet apple makers out of business. I knew there was something I didn't like about them. I didn't think they were that big of dickheads, though. It's just their fucking style and attitude. I don't like it. about Flim and Flam? Granny Smith says they were just blowing hot air. I'm not so sure. They sounded mighty serious when they threatened to run us out of business. That's it! Last cup! Oh, for Pete's sake! Oh, poor Rainbow Dash. Tomorrow, every pony! Tomorrow! Oh, for fuck's sake! Here. Oh my, oh my, out of cider again? What have we here? Who'd like a cup? Don't worry, every pony, we've got the super speedy cider squeezy 6000 to make more in an instant. You can't sell that cider. <laughs> oh, poor Rainbow <laughs> Dad. Is this some kind of cruel joke? <laughs> Every pony, there are plenty of apples in Equestria. We'll find some others and make more cider than all of Ponyville can drink. <gasps> we'll make more cider than you could ever imagine. <gasps> now, it ain't about the speed, youngin. It's about quality. Actually, I think at this stage they want speed. I never get to drinking. Oh, look at these poor, dissatisfied ponies. Ponyville is sweet apple cider country. Our cider speaks for itself. Let's put it to the test. Anywhere, anytime. Shut up, Apple Bloom. But it's enough now. With our machine, we can make enough cider in one hour to satisfy this entire town. We'll do it in 45 minutes. For fuck, shut up. Shut up, Apple Bloom. Easy, Apple Bloom, easy. What's the matter, Granny Smith? Chicken. What did you call me, Sonny? Oh. If you're so confident in your cider, then what's the problem? Tomorrow morning, right here. But I'm afraid we haven't any apples. You can use our sour beer. It'll be worth it to teach y'all a thing or two about cider making. Excellent. We have a mess. Whoever produces the most barrels in one hour wins the exclusive right to sell cider in Ponyville. Um, go Granny Smith! Until tomorrow. Don't worry, Applejack. I know you'll win tomorrow. We better. Because if we don't, we're going to lose our farm. Come on, Apple family! Come on, Big Mac. Get in the game. Come on! Applejack? Kick their asses! This is such a good idea. Me and the family are 100% confident in our cider making capabilities. And besides, no pony called Granny and Chicken. Attention, every pony! Why not get more staff? It's clearly the thing you need. We'll need it. The teams have one hour to produce as much cider as they can. 
After which, the barrels will be counted, and the winner will be named the sole cider provider for all of Ponyville. <gasps> Are both teams ready? Come on, Apple family. Ready. We have faith. Ready. Then let's... Hello there, Doctor. Go! That's actually a very good way of doing it. Great job, y'all. We've already filled an entire barrel. I bet you those guys don't even have. <gasps> oh, they already have six. You better hope that fucking speedy cider thingy mobile six thousand has enough power. Just because the apples look good doesn't mean they're always going to be. Come on, Apple Bloom, focus. We gotta forget those guys if we're gonna have a chance of winning. Sorry, sis. We don't keep up, Granny. We're falling behind. Good and good Rest when it's over, Big Macintosh. Ride, ride. Oh, poor Big Mac. Go for it. Um, Ms. Mayor, are honorary family members allowed to help in the competition? Well, I'm not sure. Flim, Flam, would you object to honorary family members helping? Are you kidding? We don't care if the whole kingdom of Canterbury helps. You soon would if they turned up. I guess it's okay. Applejack, what do you think? I think I'd love to have the rest of my family helping out. Get in there! Okay, every pony, we're not gonna let those smooth talkers take our friend's farm. Yeah! Fluttershy, help Applejack with the trees. Really? Pinkie Pie, you're on apple catching detail. Yeah, that I agree with. Answer. Rarity, you've got a discerning eye. Help Granny Smith at the quality control station. A total okay. agreement as well. Rainbow Dash, do you think you can help Big Macintosh press? Yep. In my sleep. All right, every pony. <sighs> So what's Twilight doing? Sweet apple acres. All right. Twilight, I suggest you help pick as well. Oh my god, Flourish Eye. Right behind you, Pink Pie. Lovely. Horrid. Horrid. Lovely. <laughs> Horrid and lovely. Now that's an efficient team. Come on! Come on, brother! We've got to pick up the pace! Right! Uh, double the power! Um, you're actually taking up the physical fucking screen. We've got to try something else! I've got it, brother of mine! Oh, that's horrid! Come on, Rainbow Dash! Keep grinding! We don't have time for quality control if we want to win this thing! Get back, you! One bad apple's boils that much! Applejack, help me! There's no point in winning if we cheat! We'll just have to work harder! Come on, every pony! All right then! Double time! Oh, God! Who's gonna win? How much cider do they have?
of you, Applejack. Thanks. <sighs> Integrity like that will always be rewarded. Lem and Plum win! What? <laughs> we lost? Aw, oh, too bad, Apple. Guess you'll just have to find a new line of work that doesn't match your names quite so perfectly. Now, should we tear down all these tacky old buildings and put up new ones for all the- You only got the fucking cider rights, not the farm. After all, well, this isn't Sweet Apple Acres anymore. How about Flim Flam Fields? I gotta press you into jerk cider! No, Rainbow Dash. A deal's a deal. <laughs> I fucking can't stand those two. Congratulations to y'all. The cider business in Ponyville is yours. Yeah, the cider business, not all the fucking okay, apples, the though. Fear not, every pony. There's more than enough cider to go around. <laughs> Wait a minute. Go ahead, every pony. Go on, y'all. Yeah, they all should feel fucking bad. Wasn't for that complaining, they wouldn't have ruined a family business. Hey, can't get the taste off my tongue! Mine's got rocks in it. I wouldn't pay one cent for this drip. You wouldn't pay even one cent? No! How about two cups for one cent? No! Doesn't matter how bad it is. Two bits for a barrel? No! <laughs> it looks like we've encountered a slight problem here in Ponyville. No pony wants our product. Next town. Next town. Let's go, Flam. Let's go, Flam. I can't stand them. Let's go. That means Sweet Apple Acres is still in business. Plus, we can have high-quality Apple Family Cider. Because of this silly competition, we've made enough of our cider for the whole town. And you could do that, I don't know, every year? Dear Princess Celestia, I wanted to share my thoughts with you. <clears throat> I didn't learn anything. <laughs> I was right all along. <laughs> if you take your time to do things right, you're That's a good one. Yourself. Sure, I could tell you I learned something about how my friends are always there to help me, and I can count on them no matter what. But truth is, I knew that already too. <laughs> That's the best fucking moral I've ever heard at the end of an episode. I was right all along. <laughs> <laughs> That's brilliant. That is fucking brilliant. <laughs> Absolutely nothing! That's fantastic! So yes, that was the Super Thingy Bobby. Um, I can't be bothered to say the name. Uh, very... Interesting episode! Let me be honest with you, um... Probably my least favourite due to Flim and Flam. I don't know why. I physically don't know why. But I hate them with every fibre in my body. I can't stand them. I don't know what it is. I can't put my finger on it 100% at, at this very moment in time. I can't put my finger on it. But for some reason, whenever I hear them talk, whenever they start just doing anything I want uh, my eardrums wanting to commit suicide Ugh. I can't stand them and they really dragged out that fucking song with Flim and Flam oh fucking hate those two Okay, we're gonna move on. We're gonna move on. Hopefully, this is, will be the only episode they're in. Maybe they'll be a one-off thing, and we'll never have to hear from them again. Let's hope so. If if, if any if that could be my fucking Christmas present, it could be my birthday present. It could be any. It could be my 
It could be the present I have for the rest of my life. Just never let them back on my, any fucking TV screen. So yes. Oh, I really do hate them. <laughs> I don't know. I really am surprised I hate them so much. Because I can't put my finger on why I hate them so much. Have you ever had that where you know you hate someone, but you can't put your finger on why? I'll figure it out eventually. I'll figure it out what specifically is annoying me so much about them. I will figure it out. But until then, guys, once again, thanks for watching, and until next time, goodbye!